Yo, it's your boy Coach C, and I'm just sitting here, me and Robin talking about some things about how this pandemic has affected everybody live. So look, but we're gonna talk about it for the small businesses. Yes. You know, last year this time, um, we was on a major rise. Mm -hmm. I saw numbers increasing weekly, monthly, and then bam, pandemic hit. We had to stop. Yep. Come down. But now we back, people going, coming in, and training, and I'm seeing the trend is right back where it left off at. We're back on the rise. People getting in shape. People coming in. People are trying to better their lives now. It is not only in our business. It's in all the small businesses across the nation. Mm -hmm. So we want you to continue to support black businesses. But when you do support black businesses, right. you know what I'm saying, Robin? Yes, you know, exactly. We give our money to everybody, mm -hmm. right? Clothes, designer clothes, you know. Uh, personal trainers, but sometimes our people expect to treat our black businesses different. Yes, it's totally wrong. That is not support. Okay, if you come in for training, oh, take it back. If you buy a car, mm -hmm. right, and you got a five year payment on the car, right, where can you go and pay them for a year and stop and not get penalized? I'm going to wait. Okay. You can't. Right? Your rent payment. You can't. When you set a deposit on your electric bill, when you first start off, you don't pay it on time, they charge you. Right? So why am I hearing across the city, us traders, we talk. Sure. All right, we all talk. Mm -hmm. I got a network of every trader in the city. We talk, we rap. Daily basis. Okay? We inbox each other, each other, everything. All right? Why am I hearing so much of our people stopping their contracts early, not want to do their buyout, not being committed? But you go over here to, to uh, Billy and Sally mm -hmm. and pay the whole payment. Are our service not good enough? I'm coming straight from the heart, from the rip. I don't care if you get mad. I really don't. Because we got people to feed mm -hmm. and we're under contract also. Exactly. I need to stop my contract with my, with my lease person and say, hey, I'm done. I ain't get, I ain't get paid this. I ain't making enough money this month to pay you. Let people say, so what? You signed a contract for five years. Think like this: you work your job forty hours or put in extra time because we don't work a nine to five. We're here to serve you, which is fine. That's what we do. We signed up for it, but we also have bills to pay as well. But what if you worked your job and you got your check, or you went to get your check, and they shorted you? Right. They said, you know what? We can't pay you this week. And you're like, why? Uh, because. The overhead was too high, and we, we just had to pay you next week. Next week, you wouldn't go for it. Go for it, and it's disrespectful. All right. You know, we're we're here to help you tra transform your life. Right. It, it, you know, expand your life. Expand your life. Giving you the tools. Now, of course, we can do collections, all the type of stuff. I personally do not like going to court. Mm -hmm. I don't like pressuring somebody with their payment. Come in. If you came in for training, you 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 saw after me. Mm -hmm. I didn't go after you. Right. You came and asked for me for training. I didn't call you on the phone and do a cold call and say, hey, this is Clarence from Stream Factory. Hey, I'm going to for a personal training session. Yeah, yeah. I don't do all that stuff. You contacted us. Yes. Therefore, you wanted us. So when you come in to pay and do a training, you need to abide by the contract and continue your contract until it's done. It's only a three-month contract. I don't do years. Mm -hmm. I do three months. In the three months, 30 cancel notice. Or at a, in the two months, cancel for the three months. Mm -hmm. Okay, but don't just stop coming. And I gotta call the collection people, see the collections, more money. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna do all that. I don't do wanna that. do. I don't, I don't wanna do you like that. that. I don't. I'm a nice, I wanna be a nice guy. But if this continues to happen, I'm gonna start doing it. You understand? And it should be that way, right? Because we have families too. Because you know why? Billy and Sally see collections on the first day that you didn't pay immediately and evict you. No, I know. No I'm, when I'm two days late, <laughs> I get eviction notice on my payment. I'm like, I just, I'm two, I'm, I, damn, I'm two days late. I'm like, trying to give me a minute. They're like, no, nah, eviction. I gotta pay. I gotta pay right then. They start throwing with eviction Im immediately, mm -hmm. immediately. But us, small black business owners, we don't do that, you know. So we start doing it. Maybe I could grow up to be like the LA Fitness if I start doing that and just taking your money. Yeah, if I start, I could. I maybe mean, I could get a thirty dollars square foot place. And have billions of dollars and just be really greedy like that. But that ain't me. So don't make it be me. You feel me? Right, Robin? Right. 
It's your boy Coach C and Iron Butterfly. We out. Think about it.